Two children are among four family members killed over the weekend in a crash. Police say they do have two suspects in custody and they blame the crash on street racing. Amelia McGavro spoke with a witness who is haunted by what she saw and heard. This is where the, the car turned and rolled. Yvette Acosta walked me through the terrifying moments when a quick stop at her local gas station turned into witnessing a high speed crash. A crash that tragically killed four members of the Rosales family. Parents Jesse and Lorena Rosales and their two young kids, six year old Angel and 13 year old daughter Stephanie. A third child, 16 year old Anthony Rosales, suffering serious injuries and is still in the hospital. Where was the car engulfed in flames? Right here. Right, right where that black area is. Acosta capturing the chaos of the scene Saturday night. The Rosales family car is seen engulfed in flames by the fuel stop gas station off of South Beltline. Grand Prairie police say two drivers and red and white Dodge Chargers were racing each other along Beltline around 8 p.m. And investigators say the Rosales family was heading northbound on Beltline, turning onto a side street. That's when one of those racing cars hit the family at a very high rate of speed, causing the car to flip and catch fire at the spot right behind me. Devastating and very hurtful because a lot of people were trying to help them and they couldn't get close to them. Acosta says she's still haunted by the scream she heard coming from the car. I haven't been able to sleep well. Hearing them and not being able to get them out, not being able to do anything, it's very hurtful. Police saying they now have boat drivers in custody. 22 year old Anthony Morales fled the scene and was arrested Sunday night. Police say the other driver, Jamie Mesa, is still in the hospital and will be arrested on four charges of manslaughter. Both are facing charges of racing on the highway, causing death and bodily injury. How often would you say racing happens on boat line? Oh, it happens almost every every other day, every day. Acosta says a deadly street racing crash actually happened in the same area a couple years ago and hopes something can be done to prevent future crashes. And as a mother, you know, you, I mean, it's hurtful. And I know those people, those families are going through a lot right now. And I just pray for them and hope that everything is well. In Grand Prairie, Amelia McGovern, CBS News, Texas.